guys and welcome back to Animal Crossing. Um, I'm in a little trouble. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna meet a new character. We haven't met him yet, but um, he's here to visit us now and we're gonna go ahead and talk to him. <laughs> met before at the post office, perhaps? Yeah, whatever. Anyway, let me just say thanks for buying this game Animal Crossing. I'm only half of everyone at Nintendo. Uh, what was the next part? Whatever. I got some issues to tell you. Well, uh, you were such your game, didn't you? Maybe on accident, maybe on purpose, but you pressed it. Well, um, Mr. Seti, played this morning, I thought I went to my gyro and saved. And as it saved and quit, I thought after it was finished, I pressed the power button and turned it off. But because I was compressing a video and just jamming the buttons thinking it had taken long enough to save, I might have turned it off in the middle of saving, so... I'm not sure here. The power didn't go out. So we didn't have that problem. Aha! Alright, you're listening, you're listening good, because I got a real angry when I gotta repeat stuff I gotta say. We're setting it's like pressing an emergency call button. You press it and I gotta come read you for the riot act, see? Also, you gotta save before you turn the power off. You don't save, it's the same as resetting. Well, okay, that last part I just added that. Why? Because I wanted to. Forget about other games for a minute, will ya? I'm here to suggest that you try and play this game, Animal Crossing, without hitting reset. Got it? I know what you're thinking, whether I hit reset or not should be all up to me. After all, it's my Nintendo Game View. Well, sorry, rules are rules, okay. You know what I'm saying? Let's not make a big deal out of this. End of discussion. This being our first meeting, I'm not gonna let you off easy. Think of this as a friendly warning for me to you. Oh, one more thing, this is my job, I take it seriously, so next time you see me, it's no more Mr. Nice Man. Oh yeah, and another thing, I guess I gotta say here. I really watched my language here today. I'm not usually quite so, you know, so polite. If I'm being true over here, I gotta tell you. I've been told I got what you call an acid tongue. I sort of scare people. Yeah, he, he rages sometimes, and there's lightning, and there's craziness, and he yells, and he screams, and he makes your screen go black, and your character's face go all weird. Yeah, he's not nice in this version. He's pretty slack in some of the other versions of the game. Scram! Okay, I'm slightly confused, because everything I did this morning looks saved. So either I turned it off like a half a second too early. Let me see if everything's good. So either I turned it off a half a second too early or my sister got on wanting to see my character and then just turned it off without resetting to be a troll. And she totally did probably troll me. That's exactly probably what happened because I didn't do anything. Um, anybody? We have, to, we have to go meet Kiki. We'll go meet Kiki. But the reason I'm getting back on and I had to do a couple things so this could happen Tom Nook is having a sale at 4 o'clock. Occasionally he'll have sales on carpet, wallpaper, furniture, clothing, umbrellas, pretty much anything in his store. He'll have a special sale on, well, the store for that short period of time will be nothing but his item. And sometimes he'll offer, like, something else special to go with it. So we're gonna go see what he's got in his store. He said he had wallpaper, so we're gonna go check it out. Usually it's like having a spotlight furniture item, but he'll have, like, a spotlight wallpaper. I don't need, it might be cheaper, too. Oh, there's Kiki. Hello, Kiki. And it's still raining. You've got a pretty umbrella. So, are you new to town? How splendid. Would you, uh, would you like to be friends with me? Really? Great, terrific. I didn't even answer, but okay. I'm so glad I got up the courage to ask, Kitty Cat. That could have gone badly. Mike, okay, I think I can remember that. You're so sweet, Kiki. Go burn your house down, you freaking cat! Ah! Okay, you have the same table as I do. You're playing KK Country. You think you're all Southern? Kiki, should I give you a Southern accent? I might have to give y'all a Southern accent, Kiki. But I can't do that very well, so... Even though I live in a place where a Southern accent can be found, I am not talented with it. Let's go visit Tom Buck. Welcome, aren't you lucky? We just happen to be having a special event today. Free balloons for everyone. Sweet. Oh 
my gosh, did you just give me a free balloon? Welcome to my humble store. I don't have much, but take your time and look around. What? Where is everything? You have nothing in your store today. But two wallpapers. Let's see what you've got. Gold screen wall. Nope, never gonna use that. Not worth buying. Unless it's spotlight, I could just get it in our catalog. Ugh, oh, they're both so ugly, but they're so cheap. I guess I could look this up really quick. Alright, on my game FAQs, giant Animal Crossing GameCube thing. Let's see here. Let's go to walls. Gold screen wall is not special. Plaster wall is not special. Special. None of these items are special, and they're for the same price. So we're not gonna buy anything, Tom. Look, you tried to rip us off. Can you still sell stuff to you? Yes, you can. Dang it! I wanted to see what other furniture and stuff you'd have in your store, but okay. Guess that's not gonna happen. No, I don't want to sell these fossils. That was a close one. I almost sold those fossils. Our balloon. We got a green balloon. We'll put this in our house, but we're gonna run around with it for a little bit. You can carry them. There's pinwheels and fans, which you get at other holidays, but right now, balloons you can get from sales at Tom Nook, and you can collect bunny balloons and normal balloons and all that fun stuff. You can carry them and run around with them. If you get a curse from Katrina, which we haven't met yet, and you chip on your face, you'll let go of the balloon. But you can also put them in your house and just have them chill. So we're gonna carry this around for a little bit. And since I know we won't be catching any of the new September bugs because it's raining for like the fifth day, I'm going to go ahead and donate some things. Because we do have four things to donate, and that grasshopper, that locust has been sitting in our pockets for quite some time. Yep. You're not going to say anything. It's nice and easy and quick to donate. Sorry the schedule's been... I know you guys are raging that I'm not doing Rhino Survival, but the bottom line is, I have no time. I'll let you, get, let you in on a little hint. It's not really 4 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> it's really late at night. I just finished cramming and doing a bunch of calculus for a test that I have tomorrow, and it's only the second day I've had that class, so... I'm a little bit scared, and I've got an English test paper thing tomorrow I'm doing on Passage Indian Culture. And that's only the second day of that class. <laughs> So, I've had a lot of homework, especially with cross-country going on. And I know you guys hate when I complain about my life. Blah, 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 blah. Suck it up. I'm not complaining, I'm just talking about it and telling you how much crap I have to do. The bottom line is, I have no time to record, and it takes a lot more time to record that stuff. This is something quick I can do. Animal Crossing? I'd actually rather play this than Minecraft right now. It's a little bit relaxing, and I can just sit here and talk about random things, run around in my town, and you can see Animal Crossing recording on my own time. This is, I get, I have like a half hour before I'm going to bed, I decided to stay up a little bit later so I can get some free time to not do work, and I'm like, I want to play Animal Crossing, that's the, what I want to play, I want to go to that sale. That's what I'm doing, so suck it up. This Sunday or Saturday, it'll start the actual schedule, so, and you guys can be happy because I know you want Tornado Survival. Booker, what do we have here? Maple leaf paper, yay! Oh my gosh, fall is almost here. Nothing's, everything's still green in town. A jersey barrier, great, let's put a concrete wall in our house. This will be lovely. The construction theme is so random. <laughs> Copper, do we have anything going on in town? I haven't talked to you in a while. Oh. Nope. What did he say he was going to have, though? Oh, it's a one-hour sale, so I wonder if the rest... 
if I seem to remember correctly, he's actually closed, like, he's open from, like, 9 to noon, but then he's closed until, like, 4, and then he opens back up, like, 6 or 8 tonight. He's only open for very limited hours, so I'm unfortunately not going to be able to see what he has in his store for normal stock, but we'll get to do that another day. And I'd like to do a little bit of fishing as we walk along the beach. Back in nooks, just sell the little bit that we get because I do want to sell this. Sell a couple more of my furniture items we have. Okay, that'll make it easy. Yay, 5,000 bells. I'm not sure how much it is. I think it's somewhere around 60,000 if my memory is coming to me correctly. We'll go talk to Tom Nook and see, but I'm not sure if he'll discuss it to us because he is having a sale. We'll, we'll go, we'll go anyways. Nope, we're way too early. probably have about five days left with the uh, no sea bass. They, they must be out in the deeper oceans, I guess. But I, after that, it'll be a lot harder to make money through fishing. You'll still be able to make a lot of money. You'll just it'll just take longer to make this amount that I'm making in such a short time. So we'll have to start. We'll start a food orchard. We'll have the Al Albany. We'll start a. Yeah, fruit orchard, I guess. And we'll do some river fishing. I'm not gonna walk over there, I can just do this. I'll probably fish for about five minutes or so. We'll head to Nooks and that'll be this episode. Oh my gosh, that was quick, I wasn't even ready. press that because I was trying to cast it out again. I didn't even notice the fish all of a sudden came nibbling. Sorry, I'm sucking badly. Booyah! 10,000! Maybe we can get to 60 right now. That's doable. after four, so they're going to be out. If we catch one of these, we'll definitely pay off our house today. But as you know, I'm not going to, so... I'm just going to accept the fact that I'm never going to catch another one of these. At least while I'm not recording. Why did I press A? Why did I even press A? <laughs> Stupid freaking... I need to cuss and rage and go for my remote. Why did I press it? Ah. It's only when I record. Only when I record. That was just me not paying attention. I had like blink. It was already gone. So none of you, it seem like you, any of you that are watching this at least have a town um, on the GameCube version because nobody wants items or wants to trade. If you want any items that I have or want to give me an item, I'll totally trade with you. And nobody's, why did I even press A? God damn it. And nobody's contacted me on Animal Crossing Community about trades either or anything. It's all set up, you can see the whole profile of my town. But I guess there might not be enough of you watching this. I don't know, there's still a couple hundred of you, so... 
like to think that some of somebody out there is playing GameCube. Okay. This is the third one we could have caught. Let's see if I can actually get it and not press A too early. God. Okay, boom. Not gonna cuss and rage. If I would've caught those three, our house would've been paid off. I'm just gonna give up. Screw this. I'm too tired. <laughs> and every time I cast out, I get like a tiny bit of lag. You guys don't see it on the videos, but I see it when I'm recording. That's stupid. And the freaking fish swims away. Screw you, fish. And then my screen goes into sleep mode. And I, I can't even see what's happening. There we go. Now it comes back on. It does that so annoying. It's like 10 minutes into recording, 15 minutes into recording, it goes into sleep mode and I can't freaking see for like 10 seconds. God, first world problems. <laughs> Alright, I'm giving up. I'm, I haven't caught a single fucking fish. I'm about to be pissed off and rage and I'm cranky and tired. Head hurts from calculus. I was doing fine. I caught like three fish right off the bat. There we go, finally. Okay, let's see if we can get on a roll here. If I miss this one, then I'm going. Yeah, okay, back to our house. Back to our house meaning walk along the beach and try again. <laughs> I know you guys have seen a lot of fishing, but sorry. It's what's after this, you're not going to see very much fishing at all. But I'd rather bug hunt. Oh, we still need to visit the island. Another boot? I don't want a boot. I'm not gonna go fishing anymore. I'm not gonna catch a seal again, so it's pointless to run around and attempt to catch one. I wanna catch one though. I'm running back. I wanna I catch a seal again, you guys. I want to, I want to. When that happens, I'm not even going to try. It's very easy to cheat the system in this game as far as getting more fish. Because every time you walk into a new acre, a new fish spawns. So if you really am too lazy to catch it, you can just only catch the elephants. And when they do things like that, and swim away, and when they're a pain to catch, you don't worry about it. That was really fast fish. Alright, I'll go for 20 minutes. That's my cutoff. I'm sorry, this is really boring to you guys, I bet. Like, super, super boring to you guys. I'm just gonna stop. Screw it. I've caught one. Look online if you want to see what it says. It's like, would you look at that in crazy red? It's like, I caught a living fossil. I wonder how long that's been around or something like that. And you're like, okay, wow, really? That's amazing. 
that's so cool. Alright, let's go see Nook, see how much we have in our house, and then I'm gonna go mail these fossils after I say our goodbyes. Because I want to keep these videos interesting, and not me doing the same basic things around town every single day. So that means that tomorrow night, off screen, Oh yeah, he's gonna talk about basement. We have our new basement. I have checked it out out there. It's quality crap, but so the HRA doesn't judge our basement. Great. Jacking up the house and digging a new basement. That sounds like a lot of money. But it's only forty-nine thousand. I thought it was sixty thousand at least. Forty-nine. That's so cheap. Okay, well, we're gonna do that. Then. Sell all this crap. Okay, so tomorrow's Friday, so I'll get some time. Tomorrow night, off screen, I'm going to make 30,000 30, bells. And then I'm going to record, we're going to pay off our house, and we're going to go visit the island. It'll give us something different to do. I won't be fishing, I won't be paying off our house, I won't be doing anything stupid. Um, it'll be something different that we haven't seen yet. So, tomorrow's episode, hopefully it'll be sunny. I'll record in the evening after I've made my 30,000 bells. And um, we'll head out to the... We'll head out to... Um, whatever you want to call it. The island. We'll, go, we'll be meeting a new character. Ah, oh, dang, I didn't put the fossil in it. Brick. Herp derp. Herpin derpin derpin. Herpin freaking derpin herpin. Well, this episode was different because you did. You did. Oh, I didn't even send a letter in that one. God dang it. Oh, I'm so tired. Why am I doing this right now? Uh, I'm gonna talk to you guys later. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for your support. Thank you for hanging around and waiting for Tornado Survival because I know that's what most of you subscribed for. Thank you for those of you who are watching this series. And thank you for those of you that appreciate the awesomeness of Animal Crossing GameCube. And appreciate nuclear physics. And appreciate limits and calculus. And appreciate logarithmic and exponential functions. And appreciate thermodynamics and appreciate what it's like to run 5Ks competitively and run 8 miles, 10 miles, 15 miles a day and what it's like to do things like that. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna go to sleep now. It's almost 11. I gotta be up at 6.30. Good night. Adios. Have a good life. Talk to you guys tomorrow. See ya.